hello. Ignore my look of crappiness, as always. Um, I have a little cold too, so. So, you're probably asking, why the hell are you doing another webcam? Well, I'm doing a webcam because I'm confused and slightly angry. Not really at anybody but myself. I've been through a lot, and lately I've been pretty conflicted about some, well, a lot of stuff. I can't really list everything. Obviously, boys. It's a girl's problem forever. That's why it sucks being a girl most of the time. So, I won't even tell you about this boy anymore because I don't want to be hooked on him anymore. My friend finally pointed out to me that maybe he doesn't like you the way you like him, so you gotta move on. And this was only about an hour ago, and I was like, you know what, yeah, she's right. And it hurts, but I have a feeling, why would he like me anyway? I don't see anything that he would like, and he probably just thinks I'm some freak, and I don't blame him at all. Because I am. And... He's not gonna watch this because I don't even think he knows that I have a YouTube. Even if I, if even if he knows I exist, and well, I like you, but have a good life because I'm obviously not gonna be in it because you don't want me in it. So, yeah. Um. I kind of accidentally complicated things with a friend in an accident um, with one of his best friends walking by staring at me as I was talking to one of my friends I guess it looks like he was more than the friend at the time he's not he's dating one of my friends which is kind of weird for it to look like it was more than it actually was maybe I should have done something but I didn't anyway I made things more complicated, but I guess I have to move on anyway. I don't want to give anyone the wrong picture, but I'm starting to think maybe it's best that people never know what really is going on in my head at the moment, and <coughs> I'm trying to talk to someone for a few hours. Um, but no one will really hear me. No one on YouTube or in the real world really cares about me. At all. And I don't care how many people, how many of you say, yeah, I care, I care. Right, yeah, you might. But that's different. Because saying you'll be there and actually being there are two completely different things. And I think people forget. So lesson, when you promise someone something, keep it. Don't intend on keeping it, actually keep it. Because those are two completely different things. Intending and actually keeping. You know what, I made some stupid ass mistakes. I'm only 17 and I made some really bad ones. And I wish I never made them. And... Well, look where I am. I don't even need to say any more than that. Never done drugs. I've never done alcohol. Drank alcohol enough to get me drunk or anything. So it's not that. But I made stupid decisions that I pretty much let rule my life, and it's too late to change it now. So that boy. He'll never know. His friend probably will never know either about what exactly happened at any point in my life. 
And those kids that promised me they'll be there and weren't, they'll never know either. They'll never know what I really thought, because I'm never going to tell them. But the kids that were actually there, they'll always know. I didn't have to tell them anything. I never did, never will. Because when you're actually there, you know. Someone needs you. And they appreciate you. Even if sometimes they forget to tell you. Because I was there for people. The thing was, they never appreciated me. And they never, ever will. So, it's only been about six minutes. This is less than I normally talk. So, I guess I should just wrap it up and keep this a miracle. As she gets to sleep, praying it will snow more. So I do not have to go driver's ed tomorrow. Um, I can't really tell you what's completely going on right now um as in like you know the boy and everything is complicated and quite confusing and i just don't want to think about him at all and i swear to god it's like someone's t like using him against me in a way like <coughs> i believe in god and signs I don't know what this is a sign for. I used to never see him, and now I see him a few times a week because he got randomly switched into one of my classes. Like, what is that? And, yeah. Well, I can guarantee you, he will not remember me. Not in five months when we graduate. Not in ten years when we go back to the reunion. He will not remember. But unfortunately, I always will. So on that note, good night slash good morning to all as it is 12 a.m. here. My camera, computer, whatever, um, <coughs> often thinks it is California time for some reason, but yeah. Anyway, good night to all. So, um, yeah. Thank you for your support, most of you. No, I'm not quitting or anything. Just a little thank you. Even though I don't have many subscribers or anything. So, good night. And don't forget the good deeds that people do for you. Even if they're tiny. Believe me, it took a lot of courage to do that. I remember two good deeds I've done, and it took all of my courage. But those people, they forgot. I depend on those moments every day, just to get through the day. To remember there is some good in me. So, on that note, good night. And I guess I will see you all later.